stupid Americans. Yo, how's it going, guys? You guys want to go follow me on SoundCloud at Winebox Poppy? Yeah, I'm a SoundCloud rapper now. I'm going to start doing audio content on there, iTunes, and Spotify. But, like, I really just want to get more followers and plays than my local SoundCloud rappers. So if you go help me out with that, that'd be fantastic. Thank you. I love you. Also, I have mail day every Sunday. Uh, here's the P.O. Box. It's also in the description. It's a great time. Send in something. Send in a drawing. A little note. Uh, tell me you want me to fucking die. Some fanfic of me and Miles. I know you guys all make those. If you could just draw him with a sweet pair of titties, that'd be perfect. Okay, this is a different episode. I'm not sure which number this is, but it's new to me, so now it's new to you. That's how this works. That's how this whole life works from now on. How does that feel? We also just hit 30,000 subscribers! What the fuck?! Thank you. Feels good. Let's, let's see who we're making fun of today, hmm? Stupid Americans. Oh, that's gonna be a beautiful opening from now on. <laughs> okay, actually, probably already saw that, but I just showed it again. <laughs> oh! It's like today's fucking Christmas. My favorite Snapchat porn star, Danielle! I got my court date for the annulment, and it's in a couple of weeks. You know how they were just both sitting there? What if her and her friend were just sitting there live streaming, just doing a mukbang? What if I made that the title? Danielle and her friend do a live stream mukbang. Would that be clickbait? Would that go against TOS? I'll have to think about that one. Hey. When I met with the lawyer, she told me I need to have evidence ready to show at the trial. Yeah, just like a regular drip coffee? Yeah. What size? Why the fuck did you have to show me what kind of coffee she was getting? I don't give a fuck. Coffee? Tea? Get water, you're looking kind of thick. So today, I'm meeting with my sister Sarah and her husband Paul to see if they'll sign an affidavit saying that Muhammad used me for a green card. I cannot wait to meet these intellectuals. Hey, can you sign this to show for a fact that he was using me for a green card? Yeah, sure. I feel like these people write like this. They have like the crayons in their hand. They're gonna sign it like that. Yeah, he's probably a bad guy. In my humble, educated opinion, he used her for a green card. It's hearsay. Hi. Hi. Cold enough out there? Yes. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Do not tell me that was a human. That looked like the sh that looked like a shaved owl. I haven't seen them since I asked Muhammad to apologize to them, and that didn't go very well. I can't forgive you. Well, I did nothing to you. When you hurt her, you hurt her family. Who? I didn't get involved in the argument, and I hope they're not upset at that. I hope they fucking hate you, and also put on some makeup. Look at you sitting in that coffee cafe place. Christ. <laughs> Okay, you know what? I think I'm not gonna do the mukbang title. I might just put Danielle's sister is really ugly. Because, whoa. Danielle's sister is an owl. I want to apologize to you guys for what he did that night. I whoa, what am I doing there? Ha ha ha. I thought he was gonna truly mean his apology. I thought that we'd be friends and stuff like that. Why would you wanna be friends exactly. with him? Very valid point, Aldi version of me. I want to let you know I'm really trying hard to find the perfectly heinous angle of her sister. I was trying to give him the benefit of the doubt. Okay, you give it to him already. He was here on the wrong reasons. And you're trying to prove it, but yet you're wanting to be friends with him? It was like you're wearing a blindfold through the whole damn thing. Yeah. She's like, I didn't expect this. Then why are they telling me these things? That I just, the amount of screenshots I've taken so far for a possible thumbnail this far into it, it's been like 30 seconds. I'm gonna fill up my iPad. I feel like if he walked through that door and said, oh, Danielle, I want you back, this table would probably be knocked over. By her, like by her running through the table, would he, or like would the table just knock over by itself? 
I'm gonna need you to go a little bit deeper into that one, buddy. Okay, Paul? Was it Paul? I think it's Mark, because you kind of suck. It's hard to hear how disappointed they are in me, especially since I've been working hard to show that I'm stronger than I was in the past. I, I want to let you know that you are doing a fucking awful job. Not one person on earth is sitting here going, oh yeah, her life is going to be fucking great after this. She might even get a modeling gig. I do see all that now, mm -hmm. but I've taken steps. I filed the annulment, and I'm trying to work towards that. He just looked like he was about to... And we're trying to come up with evidence to, to help prove the fraud. You know what? I wish... Why doesn't stuff like this happen in my family? This would be the greatest thing ever. I would be so fucking hyped. I would have brought a monocle to this interview. Interview. Well, I guess you could probably call this an interview. So, what evidence do you have against Mohammed? You're running out of words, huh? Did they run out of the flip cards? Or they, did it just say, um, on the front? And someone know if you guys uh, write an affidavit. Uh, Danielle, my name is not David. Mm -hmm. I'll help you as much as I can, but like this is the make it and break it. What, what is it? What is that? Make it and break it? For what? Honestly, the outcome doesn't really matter, right? Like too much. Well, in the grand scheme of life, it doesn't matter at all, because Danielle doesn't matter at all. Are you, are you watching this, Danielle? How about the lady who did the reaction for TLC? Emily, are you watching this? The same shit goes for you. It, I, it makes it so difficult because she's took steps forward before, and then he walks and sweet talks her, and she just goes totally back. You are wearing a shirt that says, Good Karma. We are wearing the same color shirt, by the way. If you're what good karma looks like, I'm gonna go break every mirror in my fucking house. Karma and luck are, are like the same thing, right? That's how that works? It's, and none of that exists. The fact that her sister looks physically fit and skinny compared to looking at Danielle is blowing my mind. Why do I want to fuck this? To the things she was doing before. It's a big fear, I think, that two days later from now, <laughs> she's pulled the annulment and he's moving back in. And they're gonna right. try to work on their relationship. I mean, that's a fear. Yeah, I don't give a fuck, bitch. Isn't it weird how this is the most exciting thing that's ever happened? I'm like, this is the most important they're all gonna feel ever. The last time she felt this important was when they put an extra hash brown in her McDonald's breakfast. Stick to the guns this time. Go through with it all. I mean, reclaim your life back. Right. It is staying this time. It is dead. This time. You forgot the last half of the sentence. You can redo it if you want. It's fine. Like, for real. Get him out of here. Don't go back. I know. What the fuck was Jabba doing there anyway? Like, for emotional support? Is she going to help you fight your sister and her husband? Probably brother. She's just sitting there like, mm-hmm, yep, mm, 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 mm. My thoughts exactly, Paul. I very much want my relationship back with my sister. But if she doesn't go through with this and she backs out again, there'd be no repairing it. Could you imagine like breaking your sister off from your entire life because she was messing with some dude for like a year and you've known her for like 44 years? We went through hell last time. I ain't doing it a second time. There ain't no way. Brother. I'm definitely ready to ride it and tell the truth and get him, get him the hell out of here. The truth. I would love to just hear that one. Do you think this is his first go with trying to get somebody deported? I'm going to go with no. I don't want to let them down. I want to do everything that I can to get him deported. Where the fuck is my MAGA hat? That little conversation right there, that's American culture right there. I tell you what, every family in America, I don't care, I don't care who you are, you sit down at your favorite cafe, and you talk about, you're like, how the fuck can we get that guy who upset me deported? Like, like I saw him loitering. He's, he's gonna need to go. Do you agree, my sweet, sweet prince? Don't worry, we won't deport you. Because if you weren't in the comfort of my home, you would probably die in, I don't know, 30 minutes? I feel like if I put you in my backyard without looking after you, you're going to get hit by a train. Sorry for the IQ loss, guys. Okay, I'm ready for this new episode, and we're going to keep going. If you say, hey, hey, this one isn't brand new. Yep. Yeah, I know, bitch. Whatever comes after this one, we're doing that one next. And then that one. I also have all of the, uh, I think they're called the 9 Day Fiance What Now? I have three of those, I think. I don't know what the fuck those are. We'll get around to those eventually. Roll that fucking Twitch clip, bitch! Mm -hmm.
Anybody who played this game, just can you please just tell me what happened right there? Because I have no idea. I did. I just took the fucking shot like a bitch. I kind of like her. I love that little speed increase a lot when you need to like get out of it. Oh! Anybody else? Yeah. 